Hey friends, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Uh, today, I wanted to do a flip through of my B6. I just got this in today. I had actually planned to do a flip through today in my B6. Um, and this is was her previous outfit that she had. And I actually like this. This came from ooh, the Planner Society. I believe and I only paid seven dollars for this and I really liked it um, the leather was fine with me it wasn't too hard it only came with four strings but I must say they were tight they were tight but I believe this one is wider than this one and I thought I placed an order for the wide but it's still okay the issue is not the inserts it's basically the extra and the um, strings are just a little looser than they were in this one so oh I just had some rollover so anyway I made this bow myself I got this little pink donut from Michaels I believe I got it from Michaels so let's open her up oh and here on the side I made this charm myself this charm right here I bought and I want to say they got it from Michaels or either Walmart it came with some beads or something and then this charm paper clip here, I'm selling in my shop. It hasn't, I haven't listed them yet. That's on my to-do list because I have some things to clean out and take off the shelves of my shop, but this will be coming soon. So I set her up immediately. I just basically took everything out of this one and put it in here. I did have like this charm was on there as well, but I decided not to carry it that over and this charm had another little piece of charm on it and I decided to take that off because it kept getting caught it was a little too long so here's my daughter I keep her with me all the time and all my and you know my planners whenever I switch I just made a die cut of her laminated it and I got this die cut but I can't remember where I got it from and I don't know if it was a gift or it came as a freebie I really just don't know. I have some of this paper here, which you'll see throughout the planner, and I just stuck it in as just some deco. This too is in my planner, and it's just some deco. And I have these uh, vinyl words here that one of my planner babes, um, Jackie, gave me. It says, we rise by lifting others up. I'm thinking I want to put it on something, but I just can't kind of keep them in my, keep this in my, um, planners until I kind of decide on what I want to do but I want to put it on top of something and she gave me another one and I just leave it there so that way I can decide if I want to put it on the outside of one of my dashboards or what have you so I kind of have that there but I know that it's there so this little homegirl here was just chilling there and I just stuck my baby right there and then this is some vellum like a uh, beehive vellum. I love honeycombs. I love bees. So this is some of the vellum. I believe I got this from Michaels. And then my planner babe Jackie gave me this cardstock as well. And I filled up my thing with it. And then this is my weekly. And this is this week right here. I've only been playing this in two weeks. This I think will be my third week coming. And this was the very first spread that I did in it. And I loved it. So that's the weekly. And I actually need my monthly up front. But I just kind of threw things in. And then here is one of those plastic inserts. And I took that same cardstock found at Michael's. And see here it's going this way. That was totally an accident. But I didn't want to waste the paper. So I just let it go that way. And then here's some more cardstock. I got this cardstock in one of those cardstock pads from Michael's. So there's nothing on the inside of that. I may just put those words over here. Some more of that honeycomb uh, vellum. And then here's some more cardstock that um, my planner babe Jackie gave me from my girl gang group. And that's the inside of it. And then this cardstock I bought from Joann's or either Hobby Lobby. And I just cut it and put it inside of the plastic there and then I tried to do some lettering and put monthly but I don't know how I'm digging that now with my monthly of course I didn't start this planner till uh, end of April May so I downloaded well yeah downloaded 
some stickers from this sticker set came from someone else and it didn't quite fit or either I just didn't know how to use it I'm like am I using it wrong I just couldn't get it uh, right so and I don't know if I ordered the right one but I just stuck it anyway since I paid for it so it's looking a little janky but this is April and then this is May. I got this May kit from the Planner Shack. Um, I love her printables. And I still don't know if I did this one right. Um, but anywho, that's how May is looking. I haven't written in it yet. And so here's the back side of that um, plastic. And what I did was take a piece of vellum, the pink vellum. And I just stuck it in there so it would just be like a nudie kind of pink. And I can actually put a picture or something in there. And then... Here is another piece of that cardstock, which I really like. And then the back side to the other cardstock. And then some more of the honeycomb vellum. And then there. And this is also some cardstock. I got this cardstock, I believe, from Joann's. And I just have this little Louis Vuitton die cut planner just sitting there. And here's some of that vellum. So that vellum, that pink vellum, so it comes, here it is. So there's that pink vellum, and this is the back side of it. And what I like about it, because over this way, it makes it just look new pink. And I think I can afford to cut some of that. And then my next insert is my bills, which everything is kind of out of whack, possibly because I just threw everything in. So, no, excuse me, this is my daily sales. And I thought this would be good for me for... Um, my business for, you know, the hair business and every day I can just put in the amount I made, like what I spent on products and things like that. So, and then I just decided to decorate a page just to see if I would like it. So that's how I decorated. I just took this little washi here that I got from, uh, where did I get this from? Hobby Lobby. And then I just took some stickers from the botanicals and, you know, some birds. You know, I need a little um, inspiration. I'm trying to find the... I did another page, like the very first page, I thought. <clears throat> Maybe I didn't. I might have just left it alone. But I just wanted to plant it so when it fell open, it just was decorated. And then... That's that. And then I got this. This is not even cardstock. This is some type of material. And at first I thought it was cardstock, but once I got it home, I saw that it was material. And I actually thought it would make a great... Uh, cover for a B6 or what have you but I'm using it as an insert and I love razzmatazz <laughs> glitz and glam so I just love shimmery so there it is and I think it's almost like fishnet a little bit with some glitter and my only concern was I don't like glitter getting everywhere but the glitter does not transfer so that's definitely a keeper and then that says bills and so I have my bills written down for the month here because sometimes I need to know what's due on the go and I leave my Erin Condren at home and I'm actually thinking of buying an Erin Condren Petite monthly planner and they're on sale. So yeah, I did this page, just put some washi tape there and then I actually did this one first and I was like, why did I do this? Let me just do the other one. So I just threw some washi tape there just to decorate it a little bit. And then here's the back of that paper or material. So I gotta figure out how to tighten these strings because they're just a little too loose for me. But I don't know where to do that. And then here's another plastic insert. I got these plastic inserts from the 1407 planners and I actually have an extra one. And it's that same cardstock because I love pink, I love gold, and I love bows. So it was just perfect. And there that is. And then this here, you all haven't seen this spread because one night I was just looking at a movie with my hubby and he complains I'm in my office all the time doing nothing, which I'm doing something, I'm planning. But I decided to take my, this is a new insert, it's the four page weekly. So you have notes over here, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then some more notes and then you have all of this over here. So, I was trying to decide what to turn this into, but what I did was I just played around with some Happy Planner stickers because I've never really seen anyone use Happy Planner stickers um, in these TNs. 
uh, layouts or whatever so I wanted to play with that and see how that would turn out and I used some of the wrong wrong stickers and I thought it came out pretty good and then I said well maybe this will be my wellness well my wellness I'm kind of running out of room in my small little mini TN wellness and so I figured a bigger one would be fine but this is too much room just like too much space so I wrote in a little bit I filmed me writing in it I believe but I decided not to post it because I don't think I like it um, for wellness so I'll figure out something else and I'm thinking this may go into be my weekly so I have more room and then that's that and then I'm debating because I would need to buy it more often so and then here's that paper again from Joann's and then I added that other pink paper going the opposite direction inside of there and some more clear vellum and then I have this and so something's supposed to go here I don't know what but I have an extra I think I have two I have an extra string uh oh and then here in the back is a little crumble I printed off of um, it's not Etsy Pinterest and it was supposed to be something else and I just leave it as some cardstock just as a little deco so I'm gonna put this here until I figure out what this is supposed to go to I think I have something doubled yeah I need these strings just a little bit tighter but I have to figure out how to tighten them yeah this oh okay here we go let's move this around I figured out I knew it had a jacket like everything has a, a place so let's put that there and because it's plastic I'm gonna leave that there here we go yeah I gotta figure out how to tighten these and at first I thought everything was gonna be too big because this is smaller um, it's not as wide and y'all believe it or not I think I want the a5 <laughs> I think I want the A5 in this because I think that's what I'm kind of what I started out with but it was just the holes and crumbles and all of that yeah so here we go we got everything together let me put this here yeah so if you know how to tighten these strings up let me know and this is by mystical little gift so see how everything kind of sticks out on the side but I'm really okay with that because y'all know I like a chunky planner she's chunky she's just beautiful the leather feels so good oh my god and then it has MLG and Co USA back here on the bottom this feels good I mean it feels really good and then it comes with the pen loop um, and I didn't know really what to choose I went off of what um, her lovely plan Shakisha had because hers looks soft okay I could tell that hers soft just like um, who else I watch um, at home with Quita I can tell hers is soft but she has white I didn't want white but she didn't have it in mystical little gift she had Foxy fix so I was just like unsure of the leather but Shakisha was very specific about what she had so I knew what to choose now I'm gonna go back and probably order an a5 from the same company and just get another color and that way now I know oh and I got it with the reinforced spine which I really like because it just kind of reminds me of a book so that's what it looks like and it's very good quality and I didn't think my bow would match I had bought some more stuff to make a bigger bow but this bow matches perfect it just this bow is, <laughs> it's been on a couple of planners but it matches really um, really really good and I just love this it just feels so good it's just oh my god it's like a baby I mean it just feel like a newborn and I just love it I really think I'm gonna order an A5 what I'm gonna do with 85 with an A5 I don't know but I'm sure I can find something and also thinking of the A5 what was it I just had it this morning oh here it goes so I had found out that my little dollar 50 was a Webster pages a5 and I had picked this up from off the planner section and it's basically a divider and you can put things in there it has a 
little slot here. So if you wanted to, you could add money or whatever. But it was just too big for my V6. So I said, well, maybe I'll get an A5 and some leather that I like. But this is great for a backup, I guess. You know, when I want to switch it out. Um, I, I do want to change them with the season. So it's kind of spring now. I thought about getting... The yellow one, this, um, I think it's coming back, the yellow one, the sunshine. And then for fall, I'm going to do um, something maybe a little more neutral. But this right here is pretty. I could even carry this in the fall. I love this. I just wish someone would buy this Nabucco, and then I could probably place an order for something else. But all in all, I am very, very pleased with it. Like I said, I... Um, Probably, I made, I don't know if I requested wide. I thought I did. It's just probably not as wide as um, this one, which you can put them side by side and you can tell. But I love the quality of this one. So I'm going to make it work. And I just think if I do any more inserts, I'll make them a little smaller. And I may just trim off because it's really, if you can see, it's really my um, inserts that are the extra, like the cardstock and stuff, that's what's um, overlapping. But as far as my planner insert things, they are stopping right where they should. So, anyway, I'm pleased with it. And I thought I wanted something bigger, but I think my little bow here, I see some um, that wire sticking out. But um, I love it. I just think... This bow right here is perfect. If anything else, I will make a double bow of this same one. I don't know if y'all can't see, but I like the wire um, bows, but they just sometimes, they can stick you. And So let me fluff her little dress up here. But she is pretty. She smells good. Oh my God. Smell good. And I just, it's a great investment. It really was. Um, I still may get a Foxy Fix. I don't know. I just think, you know, if I wasn't going to stick with it, I didn't want to invest the money if I didn't stick with it. But this right here has me wanting to stick with it. It's so, so nice. Okay, I'm not going to rumble on. But thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.